Last time we played 1 vs 7 for Rohan and today we are going to do it for Gondor! You heard Boromir, right? Today we're gonna play 1 Mercy 7 as Gonzo against 7 Heart armies in BFME 1 on the patch 1.06 on the map with the outpost. Let's get it started. This is gonna be tough. Trust me on that one. Gonzo against 7 Heart random armies on the map in that wave. They have only 3 spots. But we're gonna do it for the white tree. We're gonna do it for Gonzo. We're gonna do it for Frodo. Two blacksmiths into the Hobbit Peregrine took or Pippin, <laughs> as you know, I like to call him Peregrine Took just like Gandalf did all the time in the movies. We see Eye of Sauron, that means we have, you know, one mortal opponent. I hope it's gonna be only one, because we will need a lot of archers to deal with the Nazgul. Alright, I mean, I'm worried about the situation, but our friend Peregrine Took, he wants to only have a lunch. Hmm. Let's grab the settlement next to us, first all of all, right. and then we're gonna move upstairs to actually uh, potentially also grab these farms in the middle. There is a farm. No, where are the farms actually? There is a farm. That's going to be also our target. And there is an opponent right next to us. So I'm assuming we're going to need... I'm, I'm going to go actually for Faramir first and then potentially also for Boromir. But let's build another blacksmith. The reason why we are being uh, building blacksmiths is simple because they are way tankier. They have 3000 HP, while a farm level 1 has only 1500. So. In compared to the blacksmith, the farms are very squishy. Okay, it would be nice if we can capture this and keep this farm alive for a little bit at least, so we get some more money. The problem with Gondo is going to be the money. Because with Rohan, last time remember, we were always recruiting Eomer, and with Eomer's passive, we were able to get money all the time for killing enemy units. But such a thing does not exist for Gondo. So we are waiting here, there is no reason of going for much more aggro stuff. Um, we might also, yeah, let's actually check this area. We are no sissies, we are warriors of Gondor. And once we have 1200 collected, we're gonna recruit the captain of Gondor, Faramir. And give him the chance to show his quality. <laughs> this poor guy, I had so, actually, let's get Faramir first. And then we can buy this farm right after. Okay. Uh, with the Faramir, once he's on the field, we can actually try to creep this goblin layer at the bottom right side. Alright, right there. And the next hero on the list is gonna be Boromir. Then we're gonna go for a transition into the rangers and stuff like that. That is the plan. The farm is ready. The farm is ready. Blacksmith level 2, that's quite nice. Now it has even 4500 HP, so quite tanky in compared to a farm. A farm level 2, obviously already Rohirrim here. That's really unfortunate. And we already saw also Eye of Sauron, but he's actually trying. That's not gonna work out for you, my friend. <laughs> Rohirrim against Troll, the show match. Two of them. <laughs> Don't touch their homeland. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Okay, Boromir next. We can also pick up the heal from the spellbook, but we don't need to pick it just yet. We're just gonna wait. We can also go for the Elven Wood for some more resistant for the units. But for now, we don't, we don't have any units on the field, indeed. I is scouting our Faramir, he sees everything, like Saruman likes to say, the great eyes, he's everything. Okay, we are getting some more arches, we see Gonzo, we hope we have seen, uh, you know, Rohan with the Rohirrim and also the Eye of Sauron, we know we have at least Gonzo, Rohan and Mordor. More Gondor units are coming, as you can see. Uh, I, wanna, I wanna wait with the last hit, because I want Boromir next to his brother, this way they can share experience. Watch this now. If I'm gonna creep this one, he's gonna also level up, you see? So pretty, pretty good. Let's buy Banneketti upgrade first, and then we're gonna buy also the heavy armor before anything else. We see a lot of units as they are creeping the troll there. And um, we might potentially try to steal the money. Let's try to steal steal the money, just why not? Okay, we need to build now a... Uh, oh, maybe, maybe it was not a great idea. Our hobbits died before they could reach out. <laughs> Very unfortunate. We have to now build up the archer range for some, you know, defense. Of course, we need to get some units on the field because those units, once they are done creeping in the middle of the map, are gonna come to us. And I'm kind of worried about this situation. Why? Because um, we will eventually need to build a, a statue, but that's gonna mean we will have almost no money and we potentially gonna also lose this farm. And we will have only this one farm left for the next couple of minutes, but also this farm is going to be taken down very, very soon. 
So what we can do, what we can do now potentially is we can move downstairs a little bit to kill some units and try to get our heroes leveled. Parami needs to be level 5 for the leadership and Boromir needs to be level 4. You can also try to creep this troll layer right there if it's still around. No, it's not around of course. Uh, let's fight these archers, shall we? Get some archers on the field by ourselves. Uh, we, we have a couple of options here. The first option is, of course, go for Gandalf, but I'm assuming we will need some units because even Gandalf wouldn't be able to deal with a, in a situation like this. And it was a bad idea from us actually to build the archer range in the front side. I'm kind of assuming that's going to be a bad thing. We have already some ranges to deal with. Oh, there is even Gandalf on the field that early into the game. That's kind of unfortunate for us, not going to lie. Let's beat him. Let's fight him. There we go. With the Captain of Gondor, we can knock him down on the ground all the time. And then with the Wanding Arrow, we can finish him off eventually. You kill this. You already kill our Zitter, just like that. Alright. Captain of Gondor is available. I mean, Horn of Gondor is available to stun the enemy units. But many of them are not stunned. We are getting outnumbered big time here. And we have also no power points to go for any of the summons just yet. Looks like we are going to lose the farm next. We see Easterlings on the field. We might eventually be forced to use a heal here to save our heroes. And I think that's going to be also the case. Let's buy fire first before anything else. In group with our heroes before we are going to use heal. And ideally we want to stay next to each other. This way they can share experience. However, they have already buffed the leadership unlocked. So, this farm has been taken down. We will have to rebuild this as soon as possible. Because we will need to put the, put the ranges inside of that. With Farami, we can actually kill those units first. Try to survive until the ranges are on the field. But we will definitely need uh, a summon. The summon is gonna be Alvin Elias because we won't be able to pick up the Rohirrim. Even though Rohirrim in a situation like this would be a much, much better choice, of course. Oh, there are still many, many units on the field. Even Faramir is here. We gotta be careful about this situation. Okay, now our archer range is level 3. That's gonna mean we're gonna, you're gonna be able to shoot. Save the ranges to not lose them. Summon the units next to our heroes. This way they're gonna also deal more damage. Just like this. Nice. We need some more ranges on the field, definitely. Okay, give them, art, give them upgrades. And with the Farami, we can use a warning arrow here. We're gonna make one more and then we're gonna demolish the statue. I mean, demolish the archer range to build up the statue, okay? That's gonna be the plan. Uh, we have still many units around this area. Let's use them to kill. Okay, so we have... Oh, there is even a Nazgul. So let's beat him. Look how many units are coming, guys. And Trohan is always scary, we know that. This farm is going to be taken down eventually next. Uh, let's kill this, please. We right-click that, unfortunately. Okay. We are getting some power points. We will need to get this. Let's demolish this for now. Let's use the Elven Wood right in front of us to deny them leadership. Build up the statue. Uh, give them uh, only fire because we can train them now with our, with our heroes. This way they're going to get level 2. And there are some ants already on the field. This is crazy. How fast are they getting the ants on the field? You gotta kill this your ants before they kill our um, buildings. And another ant is here. You gotta kill him first. Let's use Horn of Gonzo. Oh, but they are not affected? They are affected, okay. Nice, I like that. Kill this ant as soon as possible. Kill him next. There we go. With almost the power points we need. Uh, for the... There we go, Farami is level 9. But once again, we have the problem. That we have no sustain here. We are also not using the aggressive formation because we don't need that. We have a lot of damage. We need to save our units. We can't afford to lose them. We have no more archer range. Keep that in mind. Let's use Rohirrim here. Heal back. We can use our hero still to deal with this units. Look how many he has. That's crazy. We need to heal up a little bit with this units. And actually kill this units first. This you know which are attacking our building. Just like that. Nice. But don't lose them. Very important to save them actually. They are getting chased down. Faramir is also around. Faramir, where is Faramir at? Faramir is also here. Let's, you kill Theodin Faramir. Uh, we, we are not able to save many units. Maybe Eagle Allies summon can be nice. We can also try to save for Gandalf, but without any farm, without one farm only. 
This is gonna be quite challenging. So, uh, yeah. Kill him. Nice. Gotta be careful with Boromir. Let's try to not lose him. We see guns out here as he's using lightning sword. Boromir has been taken down from the enemy. Our ranges are hitting very, very hard. Let's get them the kill. There is a Nazgul coming. Trolls are coming. Treebeard is here. Everyone. Um, they are smashing. Let's not commit with the ranges though. We lost the outpost, unfortunately. We lost the, uh, I mean, the fortress. We gotta use the eagles to kill. Boromir! Oh my, I even use heal. What was Boromir doing there? I'm actually confused. We have to revive him, guys. We have to revive him. Very important. We have to also build up the statue once again. Uh, now, let's kill the trolls with the eagles. We can kill this Nazgul right after. Look, this trolls. Okay. We have still this farm under our control, which is, I think, the best thing what, what is happening right now to us. Uh, let's use Captain of Gonda again, try to heal up a little bit over time. Look this damage from the from the smite ability from Eowyn. Oh, kill this end. This ends are already coming so early into the game, man. That's really annoying me. But it is how it is. They're gonna spam more and more ends, and our eagle is gonna eventually die. But it's fine. The range is inside, they should be able to take the, care of this end eventually. We are getting some more power points. The statue is up, that means more damage, and also our hero should be back in the business very soon. We gotta use Elvin Elias here for defense. Let's put Farami next to them. Our ranges are recovering over time. Let's kill these units which are attacking our statue. The Felvis is dead, Farami is level 10 now. Should be able to defend ourselves quite easily. I mean, what means easily, not easily at all. Come on, Borami, we need you. We need Gandalf too, but we have no money. Two blacksmiths and one farm, that's all we got. And we don't have Eomir, unlike with the... I mean, the heroes are dying quite fast with the statue leadership, of course. Um, also, Bonding Arrow from Faramir, if you don't know, is dealing a bunch of damage to, to ends. Look the damage now. Boom. You see? It deals bonus damage. We're gonna use the rangers to put fire on them. And Boromir is back in the business as well. Okay, now we can kill these rangers first. Don't need to kill Faramir. Thanks for the follow on the Twitch channel, by the way. Appreciate that a lot. We don't want to lose our units. Very important. Gotta save for Gunsalf. That's the plan. We are actually kinda still able to defend ourselves 24-7. I mean, Gondo in the late game is kinda okay, I guess, because of the summons. We have Eagles, which are which is pretty much the best summon after the AOD and Balrog. These units they shouldn't be able to do much, but these ends are gonna be annoying to deal with. It is Aomi always spearing our rangers like crazy. We experience whenever we can. We'll level them up to level 10. We have heal ability available. You kill this units. There we go. We have, we have so much leadership in a situation like this. And also they are highly leveled. We should be in a great spot. And we are also only 4 power points away from getting the army of the dead unlocked. We can also use now Rohirrim. But we don't need to use it now, I'm assuming, right? We are in a good spot. We have 3 ranges, 2 of them outside. And 1 of them inside. Uh, but you can already see that coming, I guess, because we eventually will have to deal with like thousands and thousands and thousands. Uh, oh, kill this Gandalf, please. Look the ranges now with this much le damage leadership. Bam, he's gone, just like that. <laughs> Let's try to protect this farm, shall we? I think that's a nice thing to keep this level 3 farm alive. Gonna give us some money over time. Okay, we can also use uh, Faramir. Faramir's warning arrow. We'll be dealing a lot of damage. Let's peel back. Use Elvin Wood. We can cover this Elvin Wood now with ours, just like that. Uh, and also put them all next to each other because we don't want to lose our units once again. Gandalf is also on the field, but I'm actually not gonna go for Gandalf's one of Gondo. Oh, he's charging in. Gandalf, you want to use Visa Plus here? But Grey doesn't hurt that much. You don't want to lose our ranges. We have already wasted the heal. We have now enough power points for EOD. I wanted to get AOD unlocked before Gandalf the White, first of all, you know? We have level 10 units now, level 5 here. This farm is still under our control. So what's the plan next, you are wondering? And I can't tell you that much, I don't know. I just don't know what the plan is. Oh, oh be careful, don't chase too much. We gotta, we gotta kill this end as soon as possible. That is the plan. We are dying quite fast, luckily for us. Uh, we're gonna wait until we get Gandalf level, uh, Gandalf, until we get Gandalf to white. Because then we will have Rohan allies, eagles, everything up, so we can potentially move for the attack. 
the could be nice. Kill these units, please. Okay. They're almost getting the power points we need for the Ganta of the White. And I think we need to attack this person next to us first, the left one. That's also a Gondor. Because there's a high chance that we can actually defeat him. Okay, Gandalf is white now. So we're gonna get mounted with our white wizard. Um, and let's move downstairs. Kill Eomir. We are getting a lot of power points, but soon they won't matter that much. Let's try to defeat this guy without the help of the eagles, uh, of the AOD. Okay. Uh, let's use the plus here. Kill the Zitter first, because that's the tankiest building. An archer range next. Gandalf is here. We can also use Easter Light against his Faramir. Just why not? Just focus down. Faramir get one shotted from Gandalf. Gandalf is the strongest hero in the game by far. Damage wise, but Aragorn is the tankiest hero. You could see how much impact Aragorn had actually in the game. So, this outpost is gonna eventually get attacked very soon. We might be forest and let's use one of the eagles actually to kill this ant. Is this a permanent ant? No, it's not a permanent ant. He's spawn spawning ants all the time. Let's peel back up a little bit and uh, use the Rohirrim to destroy uh, this base, please. So what we're gonna do now, eventually, let's. I, I want you to do something also. Is he gonna be defeated? This is gonna be the question, you know. Yes, he's defeated. That means we have only six more openings to deal with. Let's press U on the on the Allied Rangers. This way, our heroes are gonna follow them up all the time. I see Muma kill, man. Can, guys, can you imagine that? We see Muma kills and everything. Let's buy this first. <laughs> and more ants. That's a permanent end too. Uh, we're gonna build a statue here. A farm, farm. And gonna now put one of our rangers inside this. I see also ants here. There's also Saruman. This is Gandalf? That's Gandalf, right? Not Saruman. Okay. There we go. Boromir killed for some reason. This tree is so tanky. Okay, there we go. He's attacking our thing. Our outpost. We gotta we gotta rotate now with guns up, you know, back and forth all the time. We also have to kill this ant very fast. Let's use Elven Allies. Let's kill this ant. One shotting him with guns up, Easter Lights, just like that. We have now power points, everything unlocked from the spare book. I like Cloud Break here because we can use it in a situation like this, stun the enemy units, you know? And then go for abuse with Zaplas, just like boom, there we go. Let's use Lightning Swords next, our base here is safe. We only need to be worried about the ends and Mumo kills. Normal units, they should be getting one-shotted in most situations. Okay, uh, the thing is... Uh, yeah, we can't we can't really leave our outpost, right? That's the problem. Like we can't move down. We're gonna lose the rangers. Okay, our rangers are doing a nice job, though. So we're gonna rotate between the powers of Gandalf 24/7, pretty much. Oh, there is another end. But he's gone, just like that. You gotta be careful about our guns off. Uh, so I'm gonna actually demolish this farm here. Um, and let's use... Uh, there we go. We need to get a well, guys. That's what we need. Go analyze is ready. But let's wait for it, you know? I don't know why they are not shooting. Please shoot. We had this problem also the other day. So you need to always manually click. That's what I don't like to see at all. You gotta kill these rangers before they're gonna destroy our outpost. It's very low already. Gandalf is low, but we have heal, so I'm not too worried. But I don't want to be surprised about a potential kill Gandalf. But is that an end? No. We are safe for now. Kill. There we go. Okay, nice. So we can peel back now, beat them pretty much. Into the outpost. We have also uh, Visa Plus, so we can go for like... Booyah! There we go. Kill, kill Theory next. Oh my goodness. Guys, do you see the HP from my Gandalf? Am I gonna be greedy now for not for not using heal? But I don't wanna waste it because now we can recover. Oh use Hog Strike, I was scared for a second that he's gonna target my guns off. Die Legolas, there we go. Is there light next on this end? Oh I don't need to use it. Oh we used it already. But at least we are getting some levels on our guns off. Guys, we are waiting now for the Eagle Allies summon, then we're gonna rotate again. Okay? 
As long as there are no ants nearby or Muma kills. I mean, remember there is double Muma kill pen from the mod of action. Do you see that? You see double archer range here from Rohan. The thing is, we need to make sure to not destroy the farms too many times because if we destroy the farms, he's gonna buy more and more ant moods. And ants are really, as you guys know, horrible to deal with. Okay, so the plan is simple now. Look how many lands he has. We can actually cover this with one land. Use Rohirma lives first. But let's go for a Visa Plus first, right? But we have no more heals, so we gotta keep that in mind. There we go. Let's rotate. Heal back with, go back with Gandalf. And then use also Eagle Elias to kill the Tita first. He covered the land, by the way. Unfortunately for us. Don't kill the farms. We don't need to kill the farms. Let them, let them chase us. That's not a big deal. Let's focus on the outpost. Kill the Tita first. Kill the Archer range next. Focus down the buildings only. That's also Rohan allies from the opponent. There is Boromir. Oh, there is an end, right? Is that an end? No, there is a Legolas. That's what that is on the field. But why? Oh, there is an end, actually. Uh, let's... Eagles, please. You kill these buildings. Gandalf, you need, we need your assistance here. Yeah? Don't lose this. Don't lose this. Don't lose this. Aragorn is dying also in a second. We gotta one-shot this end. Very important. There is another end here. Let's use this, first of all. And, uh, yeah, we have to peel back. We gotta kill this end first. To we'll save our Tita. Let's use Elven Allies to save this one outpost. Can I use Easter Lights here? Rotating all the time. Can we, def can we, can we defend this, uh, defeat this outpost? We killed him. That's good. Oh, Rohirrim surrounding our outpost. Don't die. Oh, they are gone. Nice. Luckily, we are so lucky. But our uh, things are also gone. We gotta finish this outpost now as soon as possible. The attack continues here. Uh, where are the ants? I don't see ants right now. That's good. We have heal and AOD, but we didn't use AOD just yet. Which is good. We don't have to use it right now. Uh, we can kill this outpost, finish this off with Gandalf, right? Bam. Two hits, should be enough. Three hits, okay. Right, thank you, building. We have heal from the spellbook, I'm not too worried. Everything is getting one-shotted pretty much. Okay. Okay, this Gondor base is also... Okay, we defeated two already. We have only five more to go. But Gondor is kind of very, very easy in compared to... Um, say it. In compared to Rohan. Rohan is the hardest one. But once again, I think this... this No, this is not from Gonzo. Okay? We don't want to destroy this. Very important, guys. Don't destroy the things. Um, let's make towers here, shall we? You know what we're going to do? We're going to build uh, also Stoneworker. We can't build Stoneworker here. It is not possible. Let's go for a marketplace, maybe. Okay, this ant is getting into the range, which is good for me. So now let's move to this base immediately. This kind of is that. And here, we're gonna use AOD to finish off this base. Kill the sitter, kill the buildings. And there we go. Help with Gandalf. Hopefully this is gonna be enough. Uh, we have towers up on the field. We don't want to destroy the farms because we, got, we have some somewhat kind of good good money. Oh, kill this ant. There we go. This ant is gone. We should be able to defend, right? Okay. AOD don't sleep. Defend this. Uh, defeat this one as well. Okay. So we gotta... We gotta be careful now. Okay. This is gone. We're gonna buy this. Let's buy uh, Grand Harvest and this. Buy this next. And then go back to kill this ant right there. There is an ant we have to kill. And don't lose our level 10 units. We have no archer range up on the field. We can use um, Rohan allies here to deal with them. I saw an ant. Where is the ant when I, when I saw him? There is an ant. There we go. Let's kill him first. But we don't need to kill him. He's almost gone from the from the summon. Uh, we have to build, rebuild this. Go for a... Is that plus maybe? There we go, level 10. Use water of power here. Go inside a little bit more. Boom, be gone to the shadow. There is a well, we don't need to use heal. You chase downstairs, we don't need to kill the farms again. Very important to not actually waste into that. Uh, let's make double tower here as well. And a blacksmith. Waiting for the city to come up. And if it's level 10, our, all, all of our heroes are pretty much level 10. I like that. Uh, but sometimes they are not attacking for some whatever reason, you know? Let's put them inside again. There we go. Now we can rotate downstairs. 
And the thing is, this time we can also get spotted by our army. So we have one Ranger Battalion with Boromi and Farami here, as you can see. So let's spot Gunself with these units. And as long as there are no ants nearby, we are in a good spot. I mean, the thing is, these heroes are very tanky. You see also Drama Trolls on the field. Uh, Aragorn, let's use a Warning Arrow. I mean, not Warning Arrow, sorry. Okay. Aragorn, by the way, if you don't know, Gandalf's level 10, I mean Gandalf uh, is satellite, guys, he's able to one-shot a Aragorn if Aragorn has no Anduril and no Blade Master active. So let's heal up a little bit here. Let's always check your outpost. Looks like we will need some help here. We might be forced to use Elven Allies to deal with Gimli. Gimli doesn't take too much damage to the from the normal towers. There is a Legolas. We should be fine. We can kill Legolas with our guns off. No big deal. Okay, let's move slow. Slow, 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 slow. We gotta secure everything one by one. Actually, Gondor feels a little bit easier, to be honest with you. In compared to... Let's use Lightning Sword. Oh, but he, we missed it. He moved. Oh, did he lose Boromir? How did he... I think he was face tanking all the time. <laughs> he was face tanking uh, Legolas all the time. Just like Faramir now. Faramir! Oh my goodness. We lost this one as well. Are you kidding me? This is so feels bad, man. Let's use Cloud Break here. We lost the level 10 as well. I cannot believe it. We have to defend this one. We have no ranges inside this one, remember? Let's demolish this. We have to rebuild the archer range. We gotta save this one first. With guns off. We have heal ability available still. There is three beard. But three beard doesn't die, like unlike others. I'm actually kind of sad that we are not able to purchase the upgrades on the towers, you know? Like the laser upgrade. We have some units here. We need to revive Faramir too. Uh, we gotta kill Gimli. That's what we gotta do. I don't know if Gimli can be killable by from Gandalf. He's so extremely tanky. Yeah, he's, he's able to kill him. No big deal. The Siege! We gotta use Rohirrim here for defense. I don't know why they are not shooting. Shoot them! Let's also kill, kill three bit first. That's your goal. This guy is ignoring everything and just attacking my buildings. I cannot believe it, Gimli. Kill this. Kill these units which are attacking. There we go. Eventually, we're gonna be able to destroy it, right? This Gimli. Let's build archer range. We lost the citadel? Really? Oh no. Okay. We are in a good spot now. Let's build the towers. And let's move downstairs with Gandalf. To save this output, outpost at least. We have to make some more units. I didn't even pay attention when Legolas was actually killing our heroes. The thing is... Oh, be careful. Let's put them close to... Oh, we don't need to use Easter Lights. He's already low. Gondos, new archer range is ready. That's nice news. I like that. Let's try to save the level 10. Use Easter Light against Aragorn once again. Have no place in this world. Our Rangers, the please defend yourself, maybe. He killed the well, actually, guys. Oh, uh, that's really bad. I don't like this. We can hide out there. Are we also get getting attacked here? No, we are fine for now. Let's make some more archers, shall we? Okay. Barami and Boromi are back in the business. Let's defend. I don't know why he is not able to shoot. I don't get it. But anyways, we have a healthy unit here. Let's make a, t oh, let's make a tower here. But the thing is, we will also eventually need money, right? So, I don't know. Maybe it's not a great choice to not build any farm, any towers. Boromir and Faramir were able to defend. That's good. Let's peel back. In the meantime, this ant is sieging once again. So, we eventually have to kill him with the Easter light. There are two ants. And both of them are permanent. One is just getting too much money at this point, you know? So, we have to def definitely kill... I mean... He's also dealing some... Be careful, don't don't get attacked in the melee range because ants are hurting. So hit. When, when he's about to attack, we can dodge. That's just like that. Um, this base is also safe for now. Archer range is level 2. We can get some rangers now on the field. That's what you're gonna do. Kill this ant first before doing anything else, please. And let's put some archers inside this outpost as well. Just for defense, you know? Okay, we killed this ant. We have to peel back to the other tower. Now we can use Zaplas here, first of all. 
another castle on it, but we go. That's nice. Okay, Elmi is gonna be that, that very soon. You know, this is gonna give us money from the farms, you know. But the thing is, we have what, not many farms on the field actually. <laughs> okay, we have some rangers now. Let's put them inside this one. Get some more. We're gonna heal up over time. Uh, we have rangers also inside this one. So we're gonna we're gonna play a little bit more defensive, you know, with the units we have. And gonna play more offensively with the summons and Ganda. We're gonna rotate between this. So now is the time. Let's actually attack this Rohan at the bottom right side. I think that's the best thing we can do because we were already able to deal a lot of damage. Oh, it's a Mordor outpost now. We can leave it. I don't mind about Mordor outpost that much. I want to actually kill Rohan outpost. So we're gonna rotate now to the top right side. We don't have to kill them because Mordor is not that scary. Rohan is. And once again, the thing is, I think it's gonna be a big mistake if we're ever gonna try to destroy... Look, the trolls and stuff. Gandalf. Don't use... Oh, lightning sword, but he's gonna miss... <laughs> Okay, who's this at the top right side? Let's check. This is Gondor. I don't mind Gondor too. Let's check this area, shall we? We are command points kept anyway, right? So that's the problem. And that's Mordor as well. There are many, many Mordors actually. So we saw Mordor outpost here. Our castle is under attack once again. Kill this ant. That's your goal. You don't need to kill anything else. I see two Nazgûs flying around too. In the meantime, our... Okay, never mind. We are in a safe spot. Let's check this one. Top left. And this is... Rohan. So, we're gonna use... We don't need to use... Uh, AOD here. I mean, we actually didn't use AOD once. Maybe we can challenge ourselves and say, you know what? We're gonna try to win without AOD. Maybe that's gonna be a nice challenge. Okay, there's a troll. We gotta smash him with the Easter light. Maybe we, should, we didn't need to waste it, but it's fine. I don't want to waste the seconds of my eagle. Eagles, in this case. Uh, kill the buildings. Let's use Easter, uh, Wizard Blast here against the Easterlings. Or soldiers of Rune, they are called in BFME 1, Easterlings in Rise of the Witch King or BFME 2. Uh, it was not enough to defeat him, but we have still time left, right? So we can buy this one fast and move downstairs with all of our stuff. Because this is also from Rohan. So let's destroy this one, shall we? We'll make double tower here. And a blacksmith. That's the plan. Our bases are still looking not bad. Kill the Zitter first. Uh, with the eagles. Because eagles are dealing a lot of damage to Zitter. Unlike the Rohirrim. Rohirrim are not dealing that much damage to Zitter. Talking about the Rohirrim, they are gone. So we might be forced to use more summons here. Rohirrim are actually faster than the eagles. It's kind of random to me. I didn't expect this. Even I learn every day about something about this game. That is Eomir, you wanna use... <laughs> uh, look, no, not, not today, my friend. It is not this day. Is this gonna be enough to kill it? Yes. But in the meantime... No, never mind. We are safe, we are safe, we are safe, we are safe. Okay. Yeah, so we are safe. Kill the buildings. Oh, but we can't actually finish this off, right? Uh, this is from the summon. Yeah, it's from the summon. We don't have to take the fight. We can peel back. We might. I don't. I don't want to use AOD, but I kind of want to use it at the same time. You know. Oh, there are some more ants. Those are permanent ants. Uh, this one is permanent ant, but he's dying very, very fast. So I'm gonna actually make, make a tower. I mean, make a, make a well here. Sorry, I can't even talk. For the sustain of guns off. If we kill this uh, ant, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. Look, this damage from ranges. Ranges are the best archers in terms of damage output. They are just the best. In every situation, in those, you know, especially when it comes to deal damage, you know. Uh, the problem is, guys, we have outposts, and every outpost includes some units. But the prop, look, this Gimli stankiness, that's unbelievable. We gotta kill Gimli, Gimli first. Looks like we're gonna lose this one. Let's use this. I mean. We lost the Citadel, though. Can we defend ourselves? Looks like we can. Just peel back. They are level 10. They are very strong. The problem is, our towers are literally getting outranged by these Elven Warriors, guys. But they are gonna be gone soon. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. With the EOD rotation, we could potentially destroy this outpost easily. You know, if we use the EOD, of course, but... I'm worried about the end in invasion, you know? If the ants are gonna come, they're gonna one-shot everything. It's gonna be scary. Look the damage from the ranges, please. Bam, 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 bam. That's a hero who's getting just killed like that. 
I gotta wait for the Citadel to become up. Uh, I don't want to use my... Oh, but that might be scary though, the situation. I'm not sure. Let's use Rohan allies here. Maybe it was some overkill. Those ants are dying quite fast. We kill these buildings, please. Are we gonna lose the Citadel? It's not building up though. Oh, it's gonna be hard now for us to save this one. To rotate. Uh, this outpost has been taken down. Let's rotate to the other outpost immediately. Did we defeat him? Yeah, we defeated one Rohan. That's huge. That's huge, guys. Oh, 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 oh. Don't lose, don't lose, don't lose. Come on, go inside, go inside, go inside. Come on, please, go inside. Oh, nice. Kill the student first. Look this damage now. Once you are there. With, our, with Boromir, Boromir also gives leadership to the units inside. Let's buy this. And destroy this outpost too. Oh, this is gonna be nice. If we defeat, because I played this kind of smart, I believe this is the way to go against Rohan. If you don't kill the outpost, I mean, kill the farms, he can't spam too many, uh, because the farms, they are not de demolishing, that's that's AI, you know? They don't demolish the buildings. So you literally have to kill it. Okay, uh, we're gonna use this. We are still in a safe spot here. Uh, let's make double tower. We don't need money right now. We can also make double tower here. Make a farm or blacksmith there. Okay, so we can slowly kill this with guns off. It's, it's gonna take some time, but it's absolutely fine. Don't destroy this farm. So we are in a safe spot. We can now send this unit downstairs to this side. If also Eagle Ally is summoned in the worst case, we might need to use it. Look, this damage from this Haradrims against our build. I'm oh, never mind. I believe the towers are gonna be up just in time. Okay, there we go. Beautiful. The tower should be able to defend. We saw that this is Mordor, right? This is... No, that's also Rohan. Okay, this is also Rohan. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I'm fine with that. This is Mordor, though. But we see ant mood here, as you can see. And we also see ant mood here. Indeed, there are a lot of ants. And I believe this is going to be the first outpost we're going to lose this game. <laughs> many, many ants. Many, 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 many ants. I mean, we could use EOD, but I believe... How, in how incredible would it be when we don't use EOD? It would be awesome. Bottom here, be careful to not take too much damage. Let's buy this outpost. Yeah, we lost this outpost here, but it is how it is. It looks like they are rotating now to upstairs. With, and he also... Hmm, because I defeated his uh, uh, ally, he's also building a lot of extra ant moods. But let's check this outpost maybe. We see ants coming from downtown. Let's build a statue here. And look how many ants he has. That's crazy. Let's check this first. We see Witch King of Engmar. We're gonna use eagles here to destroy this outpost too. That's the plan. We can use Easter Knight against Aragorn, not a big deal. Without again, without Anduri's sword, he's getting one-shotted just like that. Looks like we're gonna lose this, unfortunately, but it's I think it's fine. It's not a big deal. Kill the buildings, please. Okay. But we have protection here with the ranges inside, so let's build double farm. We can kill these units, you know. Eagles are dealing so much damage, and that's what I was trying to say. Eagles are, in many, many situations, much, much more reliable than the uh, ants. Especially, you know, because they are good against anything. They are good against heroes, they are fast, you can't run away from them. They are good against units. The only weakness they have is pretty much archer units. They have some units inside, right? And Farami bottom me around as well. That's, and look this damage from these ranges. They are level 10. Even upgraded Rohirrim are dying very, very fast. Let's finish off this one as well. And then we can rotate even more, which is quite amazing because we have Elves and Rohirrim ready. Looks like we will be even able to save this one. That's amazing. Okay. Uh, they're gonna be gone now, which, which is fine. And I believe this is gonna be the last Rohan base, right? This one. No, this is not this one. This one at the top, le top left side or top middle side. So, uh, oh, we gotta, we gotta be careful though. I don't wanna lose this the second I was buying it back. Oh, more ants are coming. Ah, uh, that's really unfortunate. Let's use Cloudbreak kind of a little bit, at least. Cloudbreak does not stun mon uh, does not stun ants though. It doesn't stun also something like trolls. Uh, it only stuns units when they are level one and slows down anything in the game. So let's use elves and also Rohirrim. Commit fully. Morda is kind of bad though in this kind of situations. Morda doesn't do much. You can tell and see yourself, right? It's Gonzo and. Uh, Rohan are actually doing something. I don't see Mordo units now for a really long time, but they are all hard army, right? Hard army, yeah. I didn't make a mistake. 
Gondo feels a little bit easier, not gonna lie. Like, con and, uh, because you have Kanza, you can rotate, you are fast. There is no way they can catch you, they can, you know, kill you. Did he buy this one back? No, he didn't. So if he, if he kill this, maybe. Okay, nice. If he kill this, maybe he might be defeated, right? Rohan. We will see. We will see now. Yes, he's defeated. That means we have all we have defeated all the Rohans. We see Gonzo here, but that's absolutely fine. We can kill this drama troll too. I'm fine with that. And now we are finally able, after defeating all the Rohans, to buy some farms. That was a smart idea from us, guys. Uh, to not buy the farms when Gond when Rohan is alive. Uh, oh, there is still one Rohan. Why are they not shooting this unit? I don't get it. I don't understand why they are not shooting at the first place. Let's buy this farm. Anyway, let's rotate there. We are getting some more units here. I don't know where the last Rohan farm is. Can't tell. Looks like we're gonna lose this unit here, unfortunately. Uh, maybe here is gonna be useless here. Oh, Muma kills rotating now. Maybe I jinx myself when I was saying, oh my god, they are not attacking. Let's move now with the archers as well to this side. Again, don't buy the farms. Because I thought... I, oh, 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 maybe I jinx myself, guys. Oh, we're gonna lose them. Oh, what is my Farame doing there? There is another outpost. I don't want to jinx myself, uh, because I said I'm not gonna buy any, I don't, I'm not gonna use EOD. Oh my goodness, look the rotation from the Switch Kings and Nazgul. Uh oh, uh oh, you are not gonna kill us, my friends. Oh, never mind. We don't need to use it. We can use it here on this guy. Look this damage from this units. We lost outposts here, unfortunately. We killed the thing. Oh, do we need to use it? Oh, we need to use it. Damn, I can't. The thing is, I forget that you cannot cancel this one, you know? Okay, let's rotate. This is potentially the last remaining outpost unless they're gonna buy this one, which I think is gonna be potentially happening. But they didn't buy this yet. Um, let's help with Kanzov. The ranges are not dealing too much. Uh oh, but this is Mordor, right? So Mordor is fine. Mordor is fine. We're gonna make some towers here, make a farm as well. So we are getting some more rangers, which is fine. I like that. I like that. Uh, let's you protect this one. We have also eagles ready, so I'm not too much worried about this situation. I'm not gonna use eagles to destroy this one. We're not gonna fight and destroy this farm. Let's rotate here. Okay. Oh, trolls are charging. Destroy this, please. Let's use Rohirrim anyway. Because not using... Let's use Water of Power here. Not lose many more units. Are there in archers inside? Yes, there are archers inside. Trolls are charging now. Mordi is waking up. Was this the last building remaining, though? That's the question. If yes, this end mood has to disappear now. Yes, it has... Oh, nice. So I'm happy, I'm happy, I'm happy. But in the meantime... So let's buy this first. We have to rotate. We see Gonzo here, but it's fine. Okay? So, we now have to buy back our uh, outpost we have lost. But we need to avoid fighting this Muma kill. Gandalf, don't... When Muma kill touches us one time, we are gonna be gone. That's how it works. Uh, so, we can demolish this, actually. But in the meantime, we are also losing stuff. Okay. The Muma kill is very vulnerable against fire. Let's also make a statue here. Put one of the ranges inside of that. Just like that. Farm, farm. We have not that much money, as you can see, right? And we were also not able to destroy this one. That's why we're gonna... Use now our eagles to, to finish it off. By this farm too. Oh, but Mumo Kill is actually taking care of this. He has many, many Mumo Kills. I cannot believe that. Uh, we have the eagles. Let's buy this outpost back, maybe. We can. Would be nice. Mumo Kill Pen is kind of very, very tanky. Okay, let's use the blast to deal with the soldiers. Uh, we gotta be careful. We gotta be, I mean, paying attention about our eagles because they are not able to attack themselves for whatever reason we're gonna make one more ranger for this outpost right there now we're gonna make towers and finish off this sitter please 
And I played slow. Looks like we're gonna lose this outpost here, unfortunately, but it's fine. We actually bought this outpost here. Uh, let's defend first. We have heal. And we lost Varami and Boromi, but the problem is we have right now no money to revive them. So we eventually... Do we don't... We don't have units inside? But why are they... Oh, they are shooting, but the problem is they are shooting so delayed. I don't understand. I mean, the ranges normally have longer range than uh, normal units, no? And the normal archers, I mean. There is Gandalf, who is very tanky. Uh, so what's the plan now? I, I believe the plan is now to destroy this one. We also have to revive our Farami and Boromir. The thing is, they are very expensive now, because so much, even though we have multiple statues. And uh, now we have to deal with... We have to deal with Gandalf, so we gotta use... Uh, Elven Alliance summon here. They are no match. I'm, I'm kind of a little bit sad that I'm not able to use um, Stoneworker here. With Stoneworker it would become so much more easy. Did he use heal on his Gandalf or something? Let's kill the units first. Uh, we have some units here. Put them inside. Give them fire before that. Nice. With the fire we can kill them very very fast. Uh, we're gonna have, oh, we lost the Citadel. Which citadel have we lost? This one. Oh, many, many trolls. Many, many trolls. They have destroyed this is city. not possible. They are attacking the we must not fail. Gather your weapons. Ready your this weapons. is not possible. Gather your weapons. I don't understand why they are not able to shoot. Doesn't make any sense to me. Seriously, doesn't make any sense to me. Why am I building a statue here at the first place? I need to build a tower. Okay, so... We gotta, oh my goodness, uh, that's gonna be tough now, that's gonna be tough, we need some more ranges, we need some money though, uh, we need a lot of stuff, they are also not shooting for whatever reason, I don't get it, uh, let's buy this, uh, you buy this farm here, you rotate and destroy this farm eventually, okay, we have to get some farms under our control, maybe this farm here. Let's make triple farm. Boromir is back in the business. Boromir is going to be our next choice. Are there archers inside? Yeah, but only one normal archer. But we will need some rangers. That's what we need. Uh, they are gone now. Looks like we're gonna, we were able to save this outpost for now. That's good. They are not shooting. That's the problem. I mean, these are the same units, they have the same range, but maybe Hard Army is cheating and they have even more range than our units. Maybe that's the case, you know, I'm not sure. Okay. So let's kill. Kill! Yeah, so we are... Can, I, can, can we save this outpost, though, against Mumu Kill? I'm not sure. But we have saved this outpost, that's something. This outpost seems also to be fine. We are getting now some ranges, some more ranges on the field. And we're gonna rotate between our powers, and that's kind of, we can brag about it, when we can do it without the usage of the EOD one time. Looks like we're gonna un unfortunately lose this farm, but it's fine. We have units inside, we can beat this Mumu kills, right? But, oh my goodness. Don't beat them like this. Attack, please, please attack. Look the damage, though. Because Mumu kills are so vulnerable against fire. You see them burning immediately. Looks like we have saved the space. Let's fight for the map control a little bit more. Faramir should be back in the... Did we not revive Faramir? Apparently we didn't. There's also fire arrow upgrade purchase. We are getting some more ranges on the field. Zapla should be able to deal with them. We can also use Easter Light against this troll. Should be one-shotting him as well. Um, so, I don't know what... Maybe we can make uh, Hobbit. We have Eagles ready. We gotta wait, we gotta wait for the Rohan Elias summon, no? We have some units, but giving them upgrades is kind of harder than than I'm expecting it to be because we have not still not that much money. We eventually have to fight back, fight back for these farms because we have to invest so much into the defense, you know, towers and stuff like this. Oh my goodness! I'm actually sad if I lose this outpost. Uh, Boromir, you can maybe save this outpost here. That would be your goal and mission. It's the captain of Gonzo. For Gonzo, of course, you are screaming all the time. Time for doing you know, time to do something for that. Uh, oh, 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 maybe not. Okay, you win. <laughs> Go back. I don't want to lose you, Boromir. You are my friends. 
and I take care of my friends. So let's destroy this outpost next at the bot side. Oh my goodness, did I really waste my thing now? I guess I did. I thought he has this one under his control, you know? Fight for the, for the farms then, who cares? It's always nice when we fight for the farms. And we can now use the Eagle Allies to kill this um, outpost here faster. Let's build a statue here. Put one of these Rangers inside of that. Faramir is also back in the business. Boromir, Faramir, we're in a safe spot. Uh, buy this farm back for us. I mean, not back, we have not... We are not able to, you know, kill this farm once. Kill this drama troll, he's following us all the time, that's annoying me. We lost the citadel again? Oh my goodness. Okay. I mean... I mean... Kill Muma? Can we kill him in time? Don't let them approach. Prepare yourself. Stay focused, Ranger. We have lost we the must stay to together. The, enemy. the thing is, he's stealing so much damage. One more hit, and he's gonna be able to. Oh, nice Prepare one. Yourself. Barely were able to save. Alert, Put Rangers on in this one. Kill this troll with the eagle. Make a well here too for the defense. And we're gonna play it slow. You know, we have to play it slow. We lost this outpost here, which is really bad. Did you hear but it's it's how it is. Okay. So we're gonna, the way we're gonna play that is actually slow, we're gonna push, secure the outpost, put some arches inside for more defense, and then we're gonna do that in rotation pretty much. Actually what we can do now is we can move with these units to this outpost, right? Kill these units, kind of, there we go, zap lash should be enough, boom, back to the shadow, just like that, destroy this outpost too, Gunzov, you can do that. The problem is we won't have any more units av available very very soon. I mean command point wise. It looks like he didn't buy this outpost, I'm fine with that. So destroy this outpost. Uh, capture this outpost, I mean. Kill this mill. We can't recruit any more units as you could hear yourself. Uh, but we have a unit here, so we can potentially rotate with this unit to this outpost there. Oh, this orcs are annoying. It's not like they can hurt Gandalf, but oh look, oh but we destroy. Oh, he has the outpost actually purchased once again. Uh, okay, so let's spot them with Gandalf. Gandalf also gives you leadership, 50% armor and 200% common experience. With Gandalf being around, they're gonna be tank here. Um, let's build a statue here, put them inside as well. Capture this farm with Boromir. Make double farm for more money. It's low. We have some units inside of this one. We have now good money. We have a lot of units on the field. We're gonna play it slow. That's the best and safest way. And remember, and you gotta give me credits in the comment section down below for that one. We are not using AOD not once so far in this game. And I played actually quite smart by not destroying the farms as long as Rohan players were remaining. I killed all the Rohans first. You saw me rotating with Gandalf all the time. To make sure that we kill, you know, first of all, uh, Rohan before anything else. <laughs> Gandalf, please, kill this guy. <laughs> Dude. Okay, so destroy this outpost. And use Visa Plus here to kill this unit. It's not a big deal. This... Outpost should be also secured very soon. Actually, what we can do potentially, guys, uh, we can rotate, right? With these, with this army, let's rotate like this. This is a level eight ranger unit, so he's gonna be very tanky. Okay, that's pretty good. I'm not worried about this situation because the thing is, you can see we are playing it slow. That means we are not actually attacking the top side and leaving this side unprotected because. But it's gonna attack this side, potentially this area and this area. So this outpost, for example. We have the outpost in the front, this outpost is in a safe, is in a safe spot. That's why we don't need ranges inside of this one. Kill the moment kill. It's so tanky. Why is it so tanky? Not tanky enough for guns off, but still. Kill these units first, please. They're annoying me. Okay, so we're gonna be able to destroy this outpost soon because these ranges are hitting very hard like a truck. Level 8, level almost 9. Level 9 now, that's pretty good. 
So we can also give double captain of Gondor here, just why not? To make them level 10 eventually. Yeah, level 10, there we go. It's the highest level of the game. Uh, we gotta be careful with Gandalf. I don't wanna lose him. We didn't lose him one time in the game, so it's pretty good. I like that. Gandalf can take care of these. Not a big deal. He's trying to destroy our farm. But no, 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 no. With Gandalf around, they are also leveling up like crazy. Kill this drama troll. He's using Devastation to get some money. Let's use Zaplas here. There we go, level 5. They are also leveling up very, very easily. Uh oh! In Kill this. With no more heal, remember. Let's, Let's beat him. He's chasing our heroes. Kill this moment, kill first. Let us prepare for this war. Careful to not lose our heroes, very important. Men of Gondor. And we can defend ourselves right after. We gotta eventually Gondor use the Horn of Gondor to stun them, because otherwise I believe they're gonna be able to destroy our outpost. Stun them, just like that. We must stay together. In the meantime, prepare they are slowly and surely taking down this thing. So we can actually spot them now with this Rangers too, I believe, right? Rangers. They are level 10. We must counter this evil. Oh, what am I doing? We cannot fail. Uh-oh. Kill these trolls. They are, they are. Holy moly. Mini trolls. Many, many trolls. Many, many trolls. Uh, attack them one by one. They are dying so fast against the Rangers level 10. It's unbelievable, right? But we still lost the Tita. <laughs> oh! Oh my. No. Boromir was not in time to save his brother. And we're gonna lose potentially the level 10 too. I hope not. I hope not. I hope not. I hope not. We gotta revive Faramir, that's what we gotta do. We destroyed this outpost finally, that's pretty good. And now we're gonna rotate to the top side with the level 10, put the level 5 inside of this one. Use the battle formation, before that happens, we're gonna rebuild this. Because rangers are gonna recover over time. Mumu kill, let's see how fast he's gonna go down to our rangers, we shall see. Shoot, pew, 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 just like that. Okay, nice so. So rotate, play it slow. Um, in the meantime, wait for the outpost to come back. Faramir is gonna get revived from this one. If out, we have protection here, so I'm not worried about this situation that much. Uh, we have a level 10, so he should be able to deal a lot of damage. And we have all the summons ready from the spellbook anyway. So we are definitely doing nice so far. We have also now money. Great money. I mean, we don't have to waste time actually destroying these buildings. Okay, this is back on the field, which is pretty good. Put the ranges inside of this one. Make a tower here just for the worst case. Gonna lose this farm, but it is how it is. Let's use Blood Blast. Oh, we don't need to use it. Okay, but we're gonna use it anyway. Let's use the Rohan Allies summon to kill this one faster, right? We can also support him with the uh, Gandalf. Gandalf is dealing a lot of damage to Sita, as you can see with the Lightning Sword. In one shot that. And it's gonna otherwise take a lot of time for the Rohirrim to destroy that. We don't need to wait now. With the Rohirrim, we can rotate immediately to the second one, which is the big... Oh, oh, oh. Okay, Witch King, Nazgul, I mean. Let's kill this Nazgul with the archers. We're gonna use also Easter Lights here. Easter Light and a couple of hits from this ranger should be more than enough. One hit, potentially. If they ever get the chance to shoot... Attack, there we go. A one shot. Okay, let's not waste time. Let's not linger. And Farami is back in the business. He's gonna be at the side of his brother. Brother... Uh, we can also get this unit out from this one. Also get this unit out from this one. We don't need them inside these buildings anymore. Let's use light uh, God of power to kill these Easterlings. Uh oh. Rangers are very squishy, like mentioned a couple of times. So you don't want to face tank with them in any situation. That's why we're gonna use now the Alvin Ally. So they, this way they're gonna tank. Then we can sport with the Alvin Warriors also with the swords. This one is in a good spot, but once again, we can now group with these units and try to pressure one of the last remaining outposts from Mordor right there with the help of the... Oh, oh, there's Witch King. Look, the Witch King doesn't care about ranges because they are very weak in terms of armor, like I mentioned a couple of times. Now we gotta make some towers here, and Gandalf has to peel back because we have no heal available for the Mifrandia. Unfortunately, we lost our level 10. Stay focused, elves. So, 
That's not very good. <laughs> That's not very good. Kill this. Okay, it's fine. Or level 10, please come here. Kill up over time. We have Eagle Allies summon ready. That means we're gonna use it to destroy this outpost right after from Mordor. So that means we have one, uh, two, three, four, five outposts to destroy. Uh oh. Oh, am I gonna miss it? No. No, I'm gonna miss it actually. Do not show them fear! The enemies upon us, men! My wounds are grave! We can heal up here. Let's use Cloud Break to stun them for a couple of seconds. And where are the arches coming? They are finally coming now. That's pretty good to see. Let's now move with these two units forward to this outpost. And Farami and Boromi are gonna support them in their mission, okay? This is the plan. We are waiting for the rotation of the visa plus so we can use it once it's available once again there we go beautiful looks pretty good now the tower is up so it should be able to defend no big deal and by the time we are able to defend this we're gonna have eagles and so here the malai is available the witch king is charging in but that's gonna be a mistake because we have easter lights available let's use also alvin wood for more defense um lightning sword is on cooldown so we have to be careful Let's wait until he is forced to disengage. We are hitting very hard now, as you can see and tell. We have heal. Um, let's use Visa Plus here. Doesn't care, guys. He doesn't care. He's so tanky. He's lucky that my Easter Lights and Lightning Sword are on cooldown. Okay. Let's, let's go forward. Let's go forward. Because Easter Light is going to be available very, very soon. This outpost has been taken down. But we're not going to stop here. Uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to use, uh, first of all, Rohan allies. Why? Because we want them to tank the buildings. That's the reason why. Eagles shouldn't be tanking the buildings for us. And where is the Witch King? I believe he can't approach because he knows we can kill him in a second. Oh, there is a Nazgul. We can use Lightning Sword on him with the one hit from the... Gandalf. There we go, he goes down just like that. Nice. Kill the Zitter first. And this Mordor has been also defeated, or this outpost has been defeated at least. That's something. You see also Mumma kills there. We gotta kill the Mumma kill with the Eagle. And also, we can kill the second. Uh, we can kill the Witch King with the second Eagle, I mean. Let's buy this one. We've also, we're gonna also buy this one. Uh, let's rotate to this Gondor at the top right side. But in the meantime, shoot, please. Shoot, 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 shoot. I don't know why they are not shooting manual, uh, automatically. Why we have to always click it automatic, uh, manually, you know? That doesn't make any sense to me. You know, there is a Mordor. And there is also a Mordor. This is the last remaining base from Gondor. Our heroes are not following them for whatever reason. I'm gonna use Elven Alliance Summon as well. You see the Mordor base here. And... Mumma kill still. That's pretty unfortunate and annoying to deal with. Actually, let's make a well here for the sustain. Let's try to beat them to this outpost, maybe. Oh, we have some units also here, which makes sense, which I like to see. I mean, we can put them also inside the Zitter there. We can afford it. Make tower, tower, tower. We don't need money that much anymore. So let's wait a second. Go for a juicy and beautiful Visa Plus. This guy is using called the Horde ability. But he calls the Horde, and I'm here to destroy the Horde just like that, okay? Okay, let's make tower tower. Uh, we're gonna wait for the po power points again. We lost the well here though. Okay, we are destroying this outpost slowly but surely. I couldn't believe that this is gonna be the case, but it is the case actually. We destroy this one, that's good. Let's heal up at the well a little bit. Little bit. We're gonna put the rangers at the well. They cover first of all a little bit, then we can put them inside the zitter right after. Just like that, okay. So, okay, this more this is gonna defeat Gonzo because we see we see only Mordor outpost at this point, right? In the middle. That's gonna defeat Mordor. Uh, Gondor, I mean. If only one or two Mordor opponents left. Actually one. Yeah. Actually it feels quite easy. Much, much easier than I the last game I played uh, against Rohan. 
in which I was not even able to talk for like multiple minutes, which is very unusual for me because normally I don't need to be focused that much, but with the Rohan guys, I was focused so hard. You cannot believe that. Okay, so we can also make now some more units if we really need to. Uh, we can rotate now from all the sides, destroy all the mills. Oh, be careful. You support. Uh, there we go. So, Ovid is also doing something, which is quite nice. I like that. Let's kill this one first. We can also use Elvin Wood for some more defense. They have now maximum leadership from Gonzo. And they are fighting outside of the outpost. Uh, we don't need to use... Um, we don't need to use... Uh, say it. They have also units inside? No. We don't need to use Rohan allies here to kill this outpost though. They have level 10 ranges. They are hitting extremely hard. And also make a farm here. Make some more units. And also pressure this side. The Hobbit was able to destroy this one, which is good. This one is going to be taken down next. Yes, still many, many mills, but it's fine. The map is looking white to me. The White City of Gonzo is leading us to victory. Or we are leading the White City of Gonzo to victory. Um, Mifrandia. We can make a farm here. Now we have a lot of money all of a sudden. Yeah, I believe, you know, maybe it was me because the Rohan one was really hard. Maybe because I was destroying the farms in order to get some money and we had to deal like with 500,000 ants. But this time I played it more smart. And we actually focused on the Rohans first to kill the, you know, to kill the Rohans. This way they can't spawn any ants because I believe Rohan is the hardest. Um, and once we have done that and once we killed our uh, opponent, Rohan factions, it was quite easy for us to actually look this damage from the rangers level 10. Look this, this one battalion only. But the thing is, they are so vulnerable, you know? Let's make double well here in a farm. So let's wait for, first for the sustain. They're also rotating from this area at the same time. They have now units everywhere pretty much. Uh, let's buy this farm. You buy this farm. You buy this farm. We can't buy this farm just yet, but we're gonna do it now. Uh, I want to just make sure that everything is under our control, you know? Just make, just be sure about that. Uh, you destroy this, you destroy this, and you destroy this one. Or you two destroy this one. That's a level 3 one, that's only level 1. Okay. We're in a great spot now. We have units also here. The entire map is under our control. I like that. Uh, we can also use uh, Eagle Allies to... At this last building, at the top right side, just like that. Okay. Get all the farms so he doesn't get any more money from the map. Okay. There is one more. There is one more. So, let's not destroy him. We're gonna destroy him with, Gond with Gandalf. Get out, of course. And uh, we can destroy this mill in the middle. And there is another mill here. Let's destroy this one as well. The, ma the map is looking white. Oh, wait a second. There is another one. I don't know if we have the time we need to get in there just in time. Because you have to destroy it and you cannot buy it immediately. You know, you need to wait. I believe we have the time, so otherwise we have Elven Allies summon anyway. And I cannot believe that. But we have not even used EOD one time in this game. Not one time, guys. I'm actually feeling kind of kind of proud right now. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I like that. I'm kind of feeling proud. Uh, please be gone. This, <laughs> because of these workers, I cannot buy it. I can now buy it finally. That that's the thing. Entire base. <laughs> Not that's not true. That's not true. That is one more one more spot. We gotta make the you know you know how it is, guys. We gotta make the map white. We are playing with the Gonzo. We are playing with the White City. You know what I'm saying? Like, how does it look like when we are not able to do that? Gandalf, go, your, go, your, go do your thing there at the left side. So we have a lot of units. Uh, captains of Gondar are gonna level up those rangers and rangers everywhere. I like that. Look at these rangers. Give them some levels. It's a level 3 mil too. Destroy this one. 
Um, and then, the plan is going to be to destroy the last remaining outpost from, Gun from Mordor, which is going to lead us to victory. Okay, so, Gandalf, you are rotating down, my friends. You're going to join with the army of Gondor. Uh, let's do this like this, okay. And even Peregrine Took is going to join them. Without Peregrine Took, there cannot be victory. Okay, so, let's go. Uh, to victory, guys. Just like that. Use Cloud Break, just why not. We can use everything beside, beside EOD because that's the challenge. We challenge ourselves. And the last building is the Orc Pit. We have the full base under our control. As you can, full map under our control. As you can see, everything is white. There we go. And, and the last thing ever is going to be the word of power from the mighty Gandalf. And we see victorious. Just like that. We did it. We did it. Not only we defeated seven... Ha I mean, actually, there was no Isengard. There was one more than three Gondors and three Rohans. But Rohan was the hardest. He's still the hardest. And they were all random. So I'm, I don't influence this one. Um, but we still did it. Me. Us. Again, seven hard armies. All random. On the map with the outpost. Without using the army of the dead from the spellbook of Gondor. This was way easier than I was expecting it to be because the one with Rohan was scaring me really really off but we did it with the first try by the way I just turned on my PC came home from work tried it one time and we did it just like that I liked it guys please don't forget to leave a like on this video and also subscribe for more content like this in the future if you want to check me out on my Twitch channel twitch tv slash beyond sanders the link for that is gonna be as always in the description down below I would like to meet you in the next upcoming stream take care of yourselves and as always Stay beyond standards. Peace.